Well, good morning, guys. I was taking some photos of the garden and I decided maybe it was time for another video. It's been over a month and let's see how the garden looks. We're gone for a few weeks on vacation, as many of you guys know. Uh, so it wasn't the easiest uh, garden to come back to with the weeds, but um, I beg your patience if you see those issues, but it's not looking too bad and especially considering we've had like uh, a week in the 90s. So let's take a look. This area needs some weeding. And we took this vine off our house because it grew really tall. It's a vine creeper. I'm trying to think of the name right now. You can see the, what it did to it. We were gone and it grew wider and this far. I guess we should have decided to take care of it earlier. But we'll decide what to do with it. Some additions I got to add. Our AC units replaced earlier in the week. Gave me an opportunity to redo my plant stand or potting bench I made out of a pallet and some adjustable legs for horses, saw horses. My cactus and succulents suffered a bit while we were gone, awful winds. But anyways, for my height, I kind of like what I have here now. Composter, more plants to put out. My boxwood's cloudy, and you can see a little bit of the outline still of the shape I was going for. But we got some new growth, so I need to give it a trim. That's the vine on the side of the house, creeper vine. I don't mind it growing up this structure. Daylilies, the milk palm. Sprinklers are on, I apologize. This was definitely impromptu. These lilies are just doing wonderfully. Actually, we have some Easter lilies in there as well that aren't as tall, that are blooming now. Robin's waiting for me to move because he's putting his nest underneath my deck and he's got a mouthful of material. I'll be gone in a minute, guy. Another view.
poles you see are where dahlias are planted. So we put those in before the dahlias get too big. And we might damage the roots. Spider here. going on back here except maybe some elephant ears, some ferns, some weeds. It's rush hour guys, people going to work, sorry for the noise. crashing down during the storm. I knocked over some pots and broke them. Had a really difficult wind storm. I'm trying to duck the water. And the fish are still there. There needs some weeding, but it fills in with sunflowers and hostas and I mean elephant ears, I should say. They seem to like this sunny location. Here we go. Got some raspberries going. Day, really. It's opened up. It's called Hawaiian Chant. It's beautiful. Okay, so doing iris. Hey Winston. Hey Max. Max doesn't like the water. This is a new Japanese maple we put in here. I am determined to get past this sprinkler. Let's see how it turns out. I do like this. Mm -hmm. Not too bad. <laughs> Not over yet. I probably should just turn the things off. But I wasn't thinking I'd be doing this. Here's a new bed I put in not too long ago. Got some pastas. A little bit of spruce. And I got another Japanese maple here. Shana. 
This path is new. That's an Empress Wu. I'm looking forward to getting a bit larger. Together with daylilies, different colors. This one's getting ready to put on a flower. For the most part, they seem to be doing well over here. See where I put in last fall. I love the yellow on this. Look at that. Happy returns. From back here, we plant a lot of different day lilies in here. Look at that, that's beautiful. All American Chief. Some hibiscus getting ready to come in here. Perennial hibiscus. This for Cynthia. I took a cutting from that for Cynthia in the trash barrel. I'll keep my yard waste. And it did really well. It covers up some utility instruments. The Juga we put in here. Start ground covering. Flower. Hookeras. Got these maples. Hostas, planters, clematis growing up, the Japanese maple. I've got a honeysuckle that I bought on sale. And I'm just keeping right here, but I am going to move it so it's not doing much growth. It's morning sun only. And I'm going to move it. And that's what I do when I find something that I like. 
to buy it or if it's on sale and then I move it or find a place for it. Well guys, that's a tour of the garden. Um, impromptu, as I said, the sprinklers are running. I think we did pretty well considering. Um, that's what the garden looks like. Um, there's work to do, there always is work to do, uh, but I feel like we're not going anywhere for the rest of the summer. So whatever time I missed, I can make up. Um, but it's nice to, to be in a garden again. I love traveling, I love visiting gardens, and hopefully you guys uh, have seen a couple of videos I put online. Um, but it's good to come back and see your own place and your own animals and get back into it. So you guys have a great rest of your day and we'll talk to you later on. Bye.